Hi, this is Professor Mary, and I'm going to go over homework assignment number one. I've already opened up the file, Homework 1 Coin Spin. And the one thing I do is I always bring up my Align panel on my um, main area. And to get that, I went to Window, and I pulled down to Align, and then I dragged it over here. First thing you're going to do is go over to Layers, and right here it says Layer 1. We don't want Layer 1. We're going to name it a new layer, so I'm going to double click on it and I'm going to call this the coin layer because that's what it is. Now I'm going to click on keyframe 1 and I'm going to drag from the library the symbol called coin 1. Now remember when something is in a, the library it's called a symbol. As soon as you drag it out of the library and onto the stage it's called an instance. So I'm going to align this real quick and the instruction says that we're going to go over to um, frame number three, we're going to right click, we're going to insert um, a blank keyframe. We're going to go get coin number two, drag this one over, and we're going to align it. Then we're going to go over to keyframe or fi frame five, right click, insert a blank keyframe, drag over coin number three. And align that. Then we're going to go to seven, insert a keyframe, a blank keyframe, drag over frame or coin four, align that. Then we'll go over to nine, insert a blank keyframe, drag over coin five, align that to the stage. Then we're going to go over to frame eleven. Insert a blank keyframe, drag over coin six. We're going to align that. And then because we want this last coin to stay the same amount of frames, um, we're going to insert a keyframe at, or insert just a frame at frame uh, 13. So we're going to right click here and we're just going to insert a frame. Now I'm going to turn this on to spin and to um, loop and we'll see that if it works. So there's the coin spinning. We did that in just about 13 frames. Now what you're going to do is you'll save it and you'll submit it to the Dropbox.